if you're buying a new Ryzen 7 9800X3D or any of the Ryzen 9000s, this is what you can do to maximize its performance because you might be doing something wrong with your RAM settings and the settings for this CPU in the BIOS, especially if you're just doing defaults. Yeah, I mean, like, I have a lot of RAM. But right now I'm using 96 gigs of Kingston Renegade DDR5 RAM at 6400 mega transfers, but there are things you need to do to get the full speed of this. This software is called Zen Timings, free download. This is CPU-Z, free download, and Hardware Info 64, free download. So what I did was here, as I'm at 6400 mega transfers, uh, the memory clock is at 3200, the FCLK is at 2133, that's technically an overclock, uh, so that's really kind of nice, and then the UCLK is at 3200, so that's one to one for the memory clock and the UCLK. This was half that, so I had to make sure that I wasn't at that like one to two ratio, because when you go to 6400 mega transfers, as you see right here on the SPD page, DDR5, 6400 mega transfers, 3200 megahertz, um, this actually UCLK drops down to half that. So you want to make sure that you clock it back up for a one-to-one -one ratio so you actually get your huge performance increase. First up, when I go into the BIOS, welcome to widescreen BIOS life. Uh, DCOP is the first one that I chose, so it just gives me like the basic for, you know, this is like Expo or, you know, XMP basically. And then over here, 2133 is what I chose for the FCLK frequency. It was on auto, therefore it was a lot slower. Then I went down to DRAM timing control, and you can see your timings here. This is not about the timings in this video. I'm gonna scroll all the way down. Do, 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 do. Yeah, there's a lot of options here. Ah, oh, there it is. So, UCLK div one mode. You have two options. This is one to two. You want one to one, all right? So just make sure that that is selected. Save and exit. Well, I didn't make any changes for me, but save and exit and then enjoy. So all you really need for Ryzen 9000, and especially the 9800X3D, is 6400 mega transfers RAM, and then you can do some fine tuning after that. And this just rocks for Star Citizen. I'm getting like twice the FPS as a lot of my org mates. The sticks, hands-on throttle and stick, are by VKB. The keyboard is the Keeb by Height. The very colorful microphone is by HyperX, the Quadcast 2. And the 5.1 surround sound speakers are actually by SteelSeries, with a big old subwoofer over there and two more speakers in the rear. They're called the Arena 9s. Oh yeah, and the Light Bass 900FX by Be Quiet. Spectacular case. I really should have told you the motherboard because of the BIOS was ROG, right? So this is the motherboard I'm using for this system right here. Just answering the common questions that are always in the comment section. 